एवरीवन वेलकम टू दिस ब्रांड न्यू यूट्यूब वीडियो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू फाइव क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग प्रोजेक्ट्स दैट विल हेल्प यू गेट हायर सो अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम्स पीपल रीच आउट टू मी एंड टेल मी हे सोनाक्षी आई हैव टेकन दिस क्लाउड कोर्स आई हैव लर्न अबाउट क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग बट एट द सेम टाइम आई डू नॉट हैव एनी हैंड्स ऑन एक्सपीरियंस ऑन क्लाउड सो वेर डू आई स्टार्ट फ्रॉम इफ यू आर समन हु हैज दिस क्वेश्चन देन दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू so what i have done is i have compiled a list of five projects that cover various domains like storage networking databases serverless machine learning and many more in addition to sharing what these projects are i am also going to provide you with a link to a tutorial that will give you step by step instructions on how you go around building those projects in your environment i would like to call out one thing for the purpose of this video my focus is on aws cloud so the project tutorials that i provide will be for the aws cloud if you want to see the same video for google cloud or azure cloud let me know in the comments below so before we get started i would like to remind you to subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't already and also follow me on instagram where i share my daily life updates and also share with you a lot of career tips So with that, let's get started. Project number one is you will use cloud formation to deploy a basic web server. The reason why this is one of my favorite projects is number one, it gives you experience with cloud formation, which is nothing but infrastructure as a code. So you will write basic JSON or YAML templates to actually create all these resources in your cloud environment. Another reason why I love this project is because. it gives you experience building a vpc which is a virtual private cloud and i think that this is a pretty fundamental concept for anyone to know who is beginning their cloud journey so if you want to become a cloud engineer network engineer or a system engineer this project is a excellent one to learn the skills and have on your resume project number 2 is build a static website on amazon s3 what makes this project fun is that you get to get your own domain like talktechwithsonakshi.com then you get to build your own website you get to host it on s3 and you get a chance to play around with amazon cloud front which is their global content delivery network so this project not only gives you a little bit of a front end experience but also gives you experience with object store and helps you understand how a content delivery network works i will also encourage you to check out the cloud resume challenge by forest brazil so in this challenge he encourages you to create your resume and host it on s3 or like host it on cloud this shows the recruiters and the hiring managers that you not only are a cloud expert but here is an example that your resume is sitting on the cloud Project number three is to add a CI/CD pipeline to your S3 bucket. So CI/CD stands for Continuous Integration, Continuous Delivery, which basically allows you to automate the steps in your software delivery process. So what will happen is, as soon as you make any changes to your code, they will automatically get deployed to your S3 bucket. And the best part about this project is. you will be able to use the website that you developed in project number 2 to get a jump start for this project if you are someone who is interested in data engineer or a devops position role this is an amazing project to have on your resume project number 4 is build a serverless web application so this tutorial walks you step by step on how to build a application in which all components are completely serverless So imagine having an application where you have to manage zero servers for your front end, back end, or even for your APIs. Isn't that fantastic? So this project will give you experience with hosting your static website on Amplify. You will manage your users who log into the application using Cognito. Use DynamoDB to store information about your project, and finally, you'll also get experience with Lambda and API Gateway. I think if you are a cloud engineer, DevOps engineer or a systems engineer this is a great project to have on your resume. Project number 5 is train a machine learning model. So in this project you will learn how to train, tune and evaluate a machine learning model that predicts whether a claim is fraudulent or not. Machine learning is a very hot skill in the market currently and this project is an amazing one to have on your resume. especially if you are a data science enthusiast 
Thank you for sticking along. Now I'm going to share with you the bonus that I promised you. So the first bonus resource is the blog from A Cloud Guru. It consists of 10 project ideas that you can implement in order to gain expertise with multiple domains. I highly recommend checking them out. And what I love about this blog is they have also provided the link to the tutorials, which is again a step-by-step -step instruction. So you don't have to sit and figure out when you get stuck. You just have a list of steps that you can follow. Bonus number two is the link to the AWS tutorial page. This page consists of thousands of tutorials on multiple topics on multiple domains. So if you're someone who's interested in going more detailed in machine learning or more in depth in let's say databases or networking, then you can choose the particular domain and get a list of all the tutorials that are focused on that domain. So feel free to use this as a resource to go in depth and to build expertise in the domain of your choice. I want to leave you with one final thought. The more hands-on experience and the more hands-on practice you have, the higher are your chances of cracking that interview for cloud computing and getting your dream role. So I highly recommend doing all the projects that I have recommended, going through the blog and the AWS tutorial page and getting as much hands-on experience as possible. This will help you shine out and it will give you a competitive advantage as compared to those people who do not have hands-on expertise. And once you do this, don't forget to update your resume and update your LinkedIn. If you update your LinkedIn, don't forget to tag me. Let me know that you found my project ideas helpful. And one last reminder, subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram if you aren't already. Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day.